hi welcome to my channel power system hub today we'll see how to analyze dr uh, generated in micam p442 relay in one distance relay uh, today we'll see for distance relay and we'll prepare next video for differential for lvb for separate separate relay i'll prepare one uh, a video and how to analyze that the dr when the fault occur the relay generated uh, relay uh, save the dr and how to extract the extract the dr and uh, and save it and how to analyze let's see for, uh, for one micom p442 distance relay if you have the s1 agile software you just open it open your project after that uh, you just uh, if you have the device you can open your device in my project i have one device p442 this is used for distance protection relay so i will open this one just select the device uh, then go to disturbance record you can see here right click on it and you can see here extra extract disturbance recorded what are the uh, disturbance recorded available inside the delay you can extract from here now it is trying to communicate first then you need to extract the all the rec here you can see these are the DRs available inside this relay from starting to this and total 23 DR is available so always on the top the latest DR is available so today uh, we can see for 30 August the DR is generated my line got ripped uh, what happened to 30 August we will analyze first so I will uh, click on it and I will save now my DR is saving here on the disturbance record folder now you can see the DR is saved under the disturbance record folder. Now close it. Now you have to copy the DR from here and you have to paste in the desktop for analyzing. For analysis in the analysis of this DR you, uh, you need some tools. You can't open directly. Uh, that tool is Sigra. You can through open through Sigra or you can open through Avin because this files are in dot cfg and dot dat format so it can be easily open you need that tool you if you have in your laptop you can open through that laptop or, or install the sigra or wave in first then open in my mm, system uh, i have already the tool so it is op uh, it is automatically detect means now this file is under readable format so we will open it here in this is a uh, distance relay for distance relay we have the analog signal that is voltage and current so relay will record the uh, status of what are the magnitude of voltage and current inside that relay during that time it will record automatically so we have to check what are the uh, what happened to voltage and current when the relay got operated in this relay there are two type of signal that is a uh, analog signal and another is digital signal these are the analog signal you can see these are the digital signal these are the digital signal it is in digital form these are the analog signal this is in analog form so we have to analyze first what happened to this relay here in this relay you can see the voltage and uh, current uh, that uh, tab uh, we can check here the mm, mm, value of voltage and current what are the value of voltage and cur current you can go to this column and you select the voltage VA in my relay the voltage uh, VA VV VC represents to nomenclature represents to uh, V R phase Y phase V phase and current is in terms of ABC <coughs> so we will check the voltage of R phase you can select here and you drag the this cursor here to VA you can see my voltage instantaneous and RMS this is a 400 kV lines so you can see for phase to earth for single phase voltage thi this will be 235 kV so my R phase voltage is running to 235 kV like that you can select V Y phase also you can see what are the value of Y phase Y phase also 236 you can see select for B phase also drag to B phase and the B phase mm, and you can see voltage voltage is 231 kV so my all voltage are norma normal that is 235 kV 
Hence, there is no tripping in the relay. I think so. We'll see in that digital channel what happened to the relay. So, like that, you can check current also. What is the value of current? You can select the cursor I A and move the cursor on I A here. You can see the current is 489. Like that, I B I C. Let's go to digital channel. Here, nothing will happen. If anything open, my breaker got open this channel will be highlighted but nothing will happen so these are normal value only you can see any start will happen means there is a call in the remote uh, outer line outer line of the your outer of your protected line so start what happened that may be depend upon <coughs> your fault type so here there is no fault so Relay did not trip here only for due to start relay triggered one DR. Let's see one fault DR. What happened to uh, uh, the relay when there is a fault? We'll analyze one fault DR. I have already one fault DR. I will show you. Here one ca you can see one fault DR that is distance relay. This DR belongs to. Uh, this is R phase, Y phase, V phase. Current. This is R phase voltage, Y phase voltage, B phase voltage. This is one ABB relay DR. Here you can see nomenclature got change. L1, L2, L3. But in my com, IA, IV, IC. What about uh, the analog channel? There is no issue. We'll see. These are the what are the value of current? This is you can see. This is the current uh, in uh, Y phase. The current got suddenly uh, high. Then it is low. Oh, we'll see what uh, what is the value of Y phase current at the uh, um, before the fault was there you can see here this is the value of 0.141 means 140 ampere it is running when there is a fault suddenly the value increases to 1.29 kilo ampere means there is a fault in y phase of the transmission line what happened to voltage we'll see when there is a current increases the voltage suddenly will be decrease we'll select the voltage value in the cursor to Equal to you can see the voltage is running 63.5. Voltage is in primary 230 kV, it is running suddenly, it is it will change to Suddenly the value voltage is decreasing here. You can see this is the triggering point. Under this point the current increases and voltage is decreases of Y phase. Y phase current increase and Y phase voltage decrease. You can see it is from 30 to 35 to it is increasing gradually, decreasing gradually to 37 kg. This is the fault on Y phase due to which the Y phase current increases and Y phase voltage decreases. Let us see the digital channel. What happened to digital channel? You can see here there is a fault in Y phase. So my uh, relay detect the fault and it will immediately trip the Y phase breaker. Here Y phase breaker got open immediately. Both main and tie breaker got open immediately due to fault. Here you can see this, uh, this digital cha channel is got highlighted. Before that is normal, there is nothing happen. When there is a fault on uh, Y phase, suddenly this main and I breaker open. This is the trip relay, main one trip relay uh, due to each relay got tripped. Here main and I got open. You can see the highlighted channel. After that, then R, Y, B, R and B also open. So this is the process. You can analyze the DR, what happened to DR and how the DR got operated in any mm, MICOM P442 relay by using SIGRA. If you like this video, please subscribe.